What's good, y'all? This your boy DCPRT, aka Space of the DFS Club. Let's get into today's slate. Like my video, comment your favorite player for today's slate, and subscribe to my channel to enter the $25 giveaway. I will be having that giveaway today. I will be announcing the winner. But before I start anything, before I start anything, this slate that we just played, Cash, Showdown, and Main Slate, DK and FanDuel. Uh, FanDuel, I missed on one line, but barely. But this is the prime example on why you should join the community. This is the perfect example, and I'm going to show y'all. The early slate, uh, we played on DK. They did not announce Chris Paul being out, but one beat rider did, and we caught it. We the only, only group that caught it. Some more people probably caught it too, but Chris Paul was 57% on. He was 60% on. So the masses, the masses did not see this news, but we did. This is why you should join the community. That's why I say get with the DFS club. Let me show y'all right quick. And I sound like a broken record saying this, man, but I'm dead serious. If you want to edge, get with a community with hundreds of people, hundreds of members, my family. Uh, we got hundreds of people, I, I, hella eyeballs looking at all these, all this news that comes out. You know, I finished 18th in this showdown. And I easily cash because of Chris Paul being out and we caught the news. This right here, it says Monty said everyone was available pregame, but Cameron Payne is starting in Chris Paul's place in the usual starting lineup. And then I said there's the tweet, but they didn't announce him being out or giving a starting lineup. Paul Paul owners are fucked. We cash before the game even started. <laughs> And I laugh out loud, you know, and I said, um, they set that up, you know. Um, yeah, I told everybody we cash before the game even started. And let me show y'all the tweet. Right here, this man only got 19 likes. Nobody was looking at this. <laughs> Nobody. We caught it, though. I follow all the beat writers. Uh, I'll be on it. I'll be, I'll be on it. And we caught it and we easily cashed on that. So shout out to everybody, man, within the DFS club. That was an easy cash right there. Like I said, I finished 18th place on that line. See, Portland Phoenix showdown game. And then here's another benefit we're getting with the club. We do a podcast every hour before lock. And in a, in a podcast, I said, Conchar, he's a triple-double threat. I said that. I said, yep, said he can fill the stat sheet if he gets minutes in the podcast. And this man almost got a triple double, like I said. Uh, 16 points. I think he got like seven assists and eight rebounds or nine rebounds, something like that. It went off. And he was fairly low on, 23%. So I called him out in the podcast. That's another reason why y'all should get with the DFS club. I called this guy out too. Play for minutes. Only 4% on. Went for 30. The plan here was to fade Tillman, and I think Tillman did it, and I went with Audemar, because I figured he would be lower on than Tillman, and it will. So here goes the end result, um, catch FanDuel, finished second place on the showdown on FanDuel. Um, I was late to the uh, main contest, it filled, so I had to just get in another contest, won a ticket, got second place. Uh, DK lines right here. Uh, this is late slate showdown. Finished up 34th place. And I only played two lines. And two of my lines catch on DK. So crushed it. Also shout out to DJ24. He catch on DK and FanDuel. Shout out to my man Bones. Catching with 332. Uh, the Zillion 44 cash with uh, uh, with a two, 281. Shout out to the Zillion. And he also cashed on this line. Shout out to the Zillion. And all the lines I play, I give to the family. So whoever played my lines cashed also. So once again, you should join the family, man, that be on top of the news, that catches, you know, news that can help you out with cashing, et cetera, et cetera, because a lot of people don't do that research. But join the DFS club. Go to dfsclub.com. You got me, Scout DFS. We got community with hundreds of members. 
We play NBA, NFL, MLB, PGA, NHL, tennis, NASCAR, soccer, esports, MMA, WNBA, college sports, Euro basketball, SFL. Click join now. Click my logo. And we got four plans with the cheapest in the industry. We got the bronze plan, the silver plan, the gold plan, and the three-day pass if you want to try us out. We have built lineups, 24-7 tips and advice, GPP cash cheat sheets, bankroll management if you need help with that, live pregame podcast. We do a podcast every hour before lock. That's how I called out that cunt share play. That's how I called out the news. Um, pre light insight, we be on top of the news. So any little, any little late pivots, just like that scratch they had from Chris Paul, we nailed it. Um, that's what pre light insight is. And we also provide lines if you need lines. We got you. Join the winning team. We'll be glad to have you. So I will be going over DraftKings and FanDuel. I don't think Prize Pits got their players up yet. And oh yeah, by the way, let's do the contest. Um, let's do the giveaway before we get into DraftKings and FanDuel. So if you comment it, like, and subscribe to the video that had uh, Gobert and Mitchell on it. You got a shot to win. Let's get it. Shout out to Marv uh, Taz Demir. He said, Nick's all day, baby. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, okay, we got Nick's fan. But that's what's up, man. Um, send me your cash out info, your PayPal info. Uh, email me at dfsspace at gmail.com or DM me at dfs underscore space on my Twitter. And I see you in that money, man. Shout out to Merv Taz Demir. Okay, y'all, let's get into it, man. Um, so let's start out with Miami and Atlanta. So um, Trey Young didn't play last game, but I expect him to play this game. Um, Collins played 25 minutes. Hill played 20 minutes. Jane played 13 minutes. Bajanovic played 26. Porter played 24. Cooper played 21. It's probably gonna drop. Um, with Trey Young back, Cam Reddish 21 minutes, so they're playing uh, pretty good minutes on um, the starters. And uh, let's, uh, Miami, uh, Ball is out for illness, Bam out for rest. Um, Hero out for rest. Okay. So for Atlanta, I, mean, I like this. I like all the starters. Um, I don't know how they're gonna play Trey Young, so we'll keep an eye on that. Um, John Collins and play, and uh, Atlanta got a lot of injuries too, man. So I don't know, man. We just have to see about this game. Um, it's a lot of injuries. Kyle Lowry resting too. That's what it says. So, I mean, we'll just have to check what's going on with this game right here. So, we'll know later on in the day. Get with the DFS club. We'll know. Next is Minnesota and Brooklyn. I really like Minnesota. Uh, Minnesota is cheap. Like, very cheap. Um, you got Carl Anthony Towns at 6700 on DK. You got um, Edwards at 5600 on DK, you got um, Vanderbilt at 5K, you got Beasley at 4,800. I mean, these guys are cheap, man, and they playing against Brooklyn. They're not gonna play no defense. They're not gonna play no defense at all. So, I kinda like this stat. I expect them to play minutes, too. Uh, let's check it out. So, Beasley played 23 minutes, McDaniels played 20 minutes, Carthony Towns played 25 minutes, Edwards played 27 minutes, and Russell played 23 minutes. So, I mean, that's, that's fairly good for their price tags. Their price tags are real cheap. I really like Minnesota, man. But at the same time, we have to see about news and what these beat writers say. And um, Brooklyn, I spent on the run to Harden, Durant, the usual, you know, Aldridge. He's been playing pretty well, too. Um, 
the guy Denzel Russell resting. Okay. Um, that's even better for Minnesota. Uh, look like Brooklyn got nobody resting right now. Yeah, Blake Griffin, he's in play too. Uh, but the main guys I'm focused on is that stack on Minnesota and um, James Harden and Durant pretty much. Uh, unless they say something. Uh, let's go to Denver OKC. Okay, this game I'm really just going to skip because they both on the back and back. I don't know what they're going to do. Um, this is kind of weird slate. Um, both of these teams are on a back to back. So I expect a lot of value to come out of this game because I know a lot of people going to sit. I'm pretty sure Fat Boy going to sit. Jokic going to sit. I'm pretty sure Aaron Gordon probably going to sit. Shea, Porter, Will Barton. <laughs> Man. Oh, uh, this could be a mess. So we, I mean, we'll have to see um, later on in the day tomorrow. Um, but I do expect a lot of people to sit because both of these teams are on the back to back. That's crazy. Why would they do that? Why would they have back to backs in preseason? Blows me, man. But um, LA and um, the Kings. Um. One thing we do know is Coach Vogel from L.A. said they're going to do a dress rehearsal for L.A. He's going to run them again. So LeBron James, Anthony Davis, Westbrook, all in play. Camelo in play. He says he's probably going to do the same star lineup. That's what he said he's going to do. So I like L.A. Lakers. Uh, they're probably going to be chalky um, in Sacramento. So um, the star lineup played 20 minutes plus. Holmes played the less minutes playing 20. Uh, Davion Mitchell played 32 minutes. Fox played 22 minutes. Barnes played 22 minutes. Hartless played 24 minutes. So, Me Too played 26 minutes. Kind of a mixture. But, um, they may see a dress rehearsal too, but we have to see. But I like Fox. Halliburton back. You know, um, I like Halliburton because he's back. He'll back. The usual star lineup is going to be back, probably. So, like I said, we'll have to see. This slate is a weird slate. There's a lot of news that we need to see. A lot of players out, and we need to see lineup. So, that's basically it um, for this slate. I may have a prize piece video um, coming, after this, coming after this video. Um, so, y'all stay tuned. Uh, make sure you subscribe to my main channel, DFS Space. Um, let's get that to 6,000 subscribers. Um, like, comment, and subscribe on this channel uh, to enter next week's drawing to win 25 bucks. And uh, y'all, good luck. Make sure you get with the winning team, the DFS Club. And let's get it. Peace.